So today I want to talk to you about a very, very important command, and that is the leave it command. So a lot of times your puppy or your dog will get into stuff or will attempt to get into stuff, and you don't have the tools to get them to stop. Now you got crazy Dwayne here. We're have another episode of Train with Dwayne. And Dwayne is already eating some stuff he shouldn't be eating, okay? And that is a berry. So what I want to talk to you about is making things real clear to the dog. So I'm going to use some string cheese something Dwayne obviously really loves. And all your training should really be done with the use of a long line. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna give Dwayne a command and we're gonna give him a proactive command. So a lot of times when the dog is doing something wrong, people say no, no, no. And that is a negative for the dog, but the dog doesn't have a direction to go in on what he should clearly be doing. So if I get, wait, Dwayne, come here. Dwayne, sit, right? What I want Dwayne to understand is what leave it is going to mean. I'm going to take this, I'm going to put it on the ground. I'm going to say, Dwayne, leave it. And he doesn't know what it means yet. Tell him, leave it. I'm going to put it down. No. No. Leave it. No. No. Good. Yes. I'm going to give him that. Leave it. And I'm going to give him this. So what I want to be clear on is that I don't release the dog to the object. So I've seen some videos online where people, trainers, put the, the distraction down or the object down, tell the dog leave it, and then they cover it with their hand. The problem with that technique is it makes you an aversive. You are in the, the complicated role of blocking the dog, and you don't want that. You want your words to do that, not your hand. So I'm going to do it one more time. Dwayne, leave it. No. Now you have to be able to prevent the dog from getting there. Good boy. That's a good leave it. Right? That's still there. This I'm going to add a second distraction to. I'm going to put another piece of cheese down. Dwayne, leave it. Good boy. And I'm going to give him a piece of cheese from my hand. From my hand is always a good thing. No, leave it. Very good boy, Dwayne. That's a very good boy. Sit. I'm going to do another piece of cheese. Leave it. Good boy. So you see, because he's not getting that, he's not falling for that distraction. Sit. Leave it. All right? I'll pick these three pieces up again. And it's at that time that you're going to really make the big mistake. So here we go again. Sit. Leave it. Leave it. Good, leave it. Good, no, he did not get it. No, leave it. He has to understand you can physically block him. No, leave it. Leave it. Good. Yes. No, leave it. And because I said once leave it, it's always going to be leave it. He's never going to get over there to get this distraction. Good. Wait. All right. And he got his wait command. I'll do it again. You want to repeat this many times, but not overdo it for the dog. So I'm going to tell the dog, leave it. Good. Leave it. Leave it. That's a very good boy, Dwayne. That's a very good boy. Yes. And I give the dog, nope, nope. He's just getting into other stuff now. Leave it, leave it. Good, nope, hey. So I'm gonna take these back and we're gonna play the same game again. He's getting super excited and that's okay because he's a puppy, but he's gonna see that the control is what's gonna keep him safe and the control and blocking the negative is what's gonna actually reward him and make him very happy. There's a negative block, obviously, a correction on the leash if he goes into the, uh, goes to the distraction or the, to what I asked him to leave it. But there's a reward when he finally gives in. So we're gonna use three more pieces. Right? And don't, all these behaviors with puppies are all good. So this time, see, he's trying to get the cheese out of my hand because he knows out of my hand it's okay. Leave it. Leave it. Nope. It's a little closer now, right? Leave it. 
Very close to him. Good boy. Yeah, there's a good boy. Get a good leave it. Good boy. Right? Good. I'm going to control him. Come back and get the distractions. No, leave it. And right now, he's learning from a positive position of sit. Good boy. Good sit. Do not, whatever you do, don't do it without the long line. Don't do it without the correction. Because as soon as I drop this and I say leave it and he gets it, now it's a game. So from here, leave it. Good, leave it. Leave it. No, leave it. Very little correction now. Leave it. Good boy. Good boy. Here we go. Good boy, Dwayne. And these here, I go back. And because it's a game and he got one of those out of my mouth, out of my hand, he thinks he can get those. So when you're training your puppy, a couple things to keep in mind. One, give him something proactive to do, which is leave it. That is a positive command of something he should be doing, not something he should not be doing, right? So if I throw it down, I say, no, no, no. He doesn't have a positive thing to do. He doesn't know what he should be doing. He should be doing a down. He should be doing a sit. He should be doing a leave it. Give your dog a job to do because it makes it easier for the dog to understand what he should be doing. Dogs can understand what you want them to do, but they can't understand what you don't want them to do because then they have to read your mind. The more clear you make training with your dog, the better the training is going to be. And remember, always focus on letting your dog succeed because that's how he's going to be happy and that's how he's going to become a good dog. Down. Good boy, Dwayne Amater. Good boy. Come here. Come here. <laughs> yeah, we got plenty of cheese for you. We got plenty of cheese for the Dwayne Amater. Do me a favor, give this video a thumbs up, like this channel, subscribe to this channel. There's hundreds of videos updated every day with tons of information to make your life with your dog a lot better and a lot happier. Thank you. Say bye, Dwayne. Say bye, Dwayne Amater. Come here. Oh, 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 oh. oh he's a Dwayne Amater. He's a Dwayne Amater. Down. Yeah, good boy. Down. Yeah, yes. Good boy. Hey, there you go.